What is up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, thank you for taking the time to watch one of my videos. Today we're going to be talking about a quick tip in Final Cut Pro 10 to help you scrub your footage faster. So with that, let's get into it. I have just a library pulled up here um, from an event that um, I filmed at the, the last weekend um, called Skate Fest Omaha. I'm actually wearing the shirt right now. It's pretty sick. Um, so anyway, just a very quick demonstration here. You'll see right here up in this um, panel, I have um, some footage just pulled in there. Typically when I start an edit, I like to go through the footage, watch it, select my favorite parts, parts and clips that I know will I will use, um, and then I can filter right here to favorites and then it's just a bunch of clips that I know are good and I know I can use. So that being said, how do we get there? You go to all clips, now a few keyboard shortcuts. This is the major key to making this go fast. If you look on your keyboard, J, K, L are gonna be your primary playback option keyboard shortcuts. So K is gonna pause the video. L on the right side is gonna start the video. You see it scrub through press K to pause it, and J is going to rewind the video. So this makes it really quick and easy to navigate within a clip, and if you double click it will go even faster on L, or you can do the same thing backwards. So each time you press it you can think of it as like a fast forwarding or rewinding remote control. So JKL, super quick. The other keyboard shortcut that goes with this, and these are all, um, these are all preloaded, I did not set up any custom keyboard shortcuts for these so you should if you put just pull up Final Cut Pro you should be able to navigate the same exact way another keyboard shortcut that is really helpful if you want to say you're in the middle um, of a clip and you want to jump to the beginning or end you have your JKL keys right next to that you have your colon key if you hit colon it'll skip back to the beginning and next to that you have your quotation key if you hit the quotes it'll skip to the end of the clip that is super helpful when you're scrubbing, and I'll show you an example. I'll restart on this one. So I'm playing this one, playing this one. Okay, let's set an in and out point. I'll hit I for an end point. Um, watch it. Okay, I want that. So I'll hit O for an out point. So that marks, that marks my clip. Now I can hit F to favorite that, but say I want to move to the next clip. I don't know how. If I just hit that quotation marks twice, that takes me to my next clip. My hand never has to come off the keyboard. It never has to go to my mouse and navigate. Of course, you can scrub this manually um, and just select and click. It's harder and more time consuming, in my opinion, to do that. So if you can just stick to the J, K, L, and then your colon and your quotation marks, you will be all set and you will be flying through your footage, scrubbing just your favorite moments and your best clips. That's just a quick tip to help you guys get through your editing faster. I know I always enjoy learning from other creators and YouTubers on how to expedite the editing workflow because it is not my strong suit. If you wanna see more videos like this, give this video a like, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell for notifications so you don't miss when I drop a new video every week. And with that, we'll see you in the next one.